Hey guys, and welcome back to <clears throat> Fatal Frame 2. Uh, I'm trying my new wireless controller out, the one that was all sticky and icky. I just spent an hour uh, cleaning the whole thing with uh, isopropyl alcohol, 99%, and it seems to have worked, so fingers crossed. Right, okay. So let's go over here. I just looked up what we've got to do, and I think we've got to head over this way. Because if we look on the map, there's a save lantern there with a red X. Ooh. Entering man. Okay. Well, that's nice and ominous. Uh, I suppose we will give this a bit of a save and uh, have a look and see what the entering man is doing. guessing we can now go into this house maybe oh good and we get a crash straight away fantastic all right let's try that with a little bit more uh, a little bit more no uh, a little bit less crashing if we can that would be fantastic okay so what we got going on here let's switch over to our unlimited film so, what have we got? A different place can be seen in the photo. It looks like a well somewhere. Well, we know roughly where that is. There was a well back um, just past the storehouse, wasn't there? Or just before you get to the storehouse, I should say. Let's go and take a gander at that. Yeah, not sure why my Xbox crashes so much. I have no idea. Uh, I don't know whether it's a bad mod or old achy breaky hard drive or who knows. Maybe I'll uh, <clears throat> get it serviced at some point. Maybe Xbox emulation will actually, you know, get good. Well, it will get good. It's just a matter of time. Um, okay. Oh. Yeah, we're, we're not a million miles away from decent Xbox animation. An image of a person can be seen in the photo. Okay. I did wonder what that was that we were looking at. Okay. Well. And, yeah. Uh, I'm... Actually, we'll save it over here before we go back into that house. I'm guessing that's unlocked the door now. And I guess that's going to let us go back down to the bridge. Uh, the Earth Bridge. That we've heard so much about. That is apparently underground. Spoopy. We like our spoopy underground experiences. <clears throat> yeah, we're going to hit up the save point as well. Uh, the crash is... Uh, are infrequent but you know they're annoying enough that I don't really want to keep chancing them I'm sure you guys understand um, I have uh, I was playing um, what was I playing yesterday testing it out uh, Metal. oh yeah I was playing Metal of Honor Rising Sun I played a little bit of it on the Playstation 2 and then I played it a bit on the original Xbox and Oh man, the original Xbox version is so much better. Strange presence that was blocking the entrance of the door is gone now. It looks as if you can enter the building here. Aye. Yeah, on the PlayStation, uh, it, ooh, new chapter. It really does, ooh, go down to like slideshow territory. Dazed girl. Don't know where she was. Right, let's explore. Filled with soot. Doesn't look as if doesn't look as if it's been used for a long time. Hmm. Hopefully we can find ourselves some goodies. What's that? There's a cloth with a picture of a bamboo on it. Hanging there. It's been hanging here for so long the colour has faded and the material is crumbling. Oh well, that's not good. Okay. 
I'd really like some health. Oh, there is a flashy thing. Don't kill you. Who said that? I don't have any immediate plans of killing anybody. Unless you're a ghost. You didn't want to kill me, huh? Well, you don't have to. We. Ooh! We can talk about this. Some, oh, nice. As she's starting to not exactly run low, but starting to use a good chunk of our film. Nice herbal medicine. We'll have that. How many of those do we have now, actually? Oh, man. We really are low on the... Oh no, it's type 14, yeah, we'll... Mm, okay. Got 3-0. Go We've got 18 herbal medicines. Cool. Now, I know that sounds like a lot, but... It does go through bloody fast. Let's follow these creepy twins. I'm guessing they know. Oh, that was a nice amount of points. Speaking of points... It's right, so we're back up to 21,000 points. Uh, is there anything that we can power up? I want to put another orb in that and I think we might as well add another orb to that so we can upgrade all of these basic functions now the amount of uh, spirit power that can be charged um is it worth upgrading that uh, we don't seem to need it yet <sighs> I'm not really sure to upgrade next we'll cross that bridge when we get to it So, house is so old, maybe the whole room has warped, yeah. They're in trouble with wood. It does warp. Type 61? Ooh, we'll have that. There's only whinging about that a minute ago. There's a hanging painting on the wall, but even its mount is crumbling. The surface of the painting is so mouldy that you can only make out a few leaf-like markings. Ooh. Okay, we have a map. Right, so we've been in those two. So we've got a door here. The door is locked, because of course it is. It doesn't mark doors that are locked, uh, unfortunately. <clears throat> kind of wish it did, but I guess we can't have everything now, can we? Ooh. There's an urn and a scroll on display in the alcove. The urn is broken and its shards lie scattered all around. That's no good. Nothing in any of these, but there is an item in this corner. Go grab that. Hey, herbal medicine. Don't mind if I do. Oh god, how big is this place? Pretty big, apparently. The lantern. Where does this... Have we crashed again, haven't we? Ah, bollocks. Why is it doing this? Right, one second, guys. And we're back. Right, so... I've cleared the Xbox cache, uh, which apparently can help. I've never actually done that before, so who knows. Right, my... Ooh, nice. My spidey senses are tingling. So there's just some accounts of an old ritual. Nothing too interesting there. Ooh, this room's got a lot of random bits and bobs in. Any goodies, though? 
Uh, beautiful folding screen standing beyond the chest of drawers. There's a picture of crimson butterflies fluttering below. Yeah, so that's kind of a big thing. Small mirror stands covered with red cloths are lined up here. Beyond them, there is a pair of dolls. Everything seems to come in pairs in this room. Yeah. Some kind of twin room. I guess. T twins room, yeah. I guess so. Alright, well, let's keep going. Ooh! Really? Oh, that was fucking shit. See what I mean? Sometimes it just doesn't auto lock onto the what you want to shoot, and sometimes it does. An old book is lying in front of the mirror. Violet Diary 2. My hands closed around Azumi's neck. It was soft, warm, alive. My grip seemed to cause her so much pain at the very end the veiled priest came in to help me. But Azumi said she wanted only me to do it. I became one with Azumi, but now she's gone. I can't talk about it anymore. Father brought Azumi back. All I could do was apologize. She forgave me. The killing is over now. No more. I'll never hurt anybody again. I'll never let anybody kill again. Father says Azumi has been possessed and he's trying to kill her. He's trying to kill Azumi. I won't let him do it. I won't let that happen anymore. So... She killed him and then her dad brought her back and then she was possessed again? Uh, okay. Sure, I guess. Listen to the maze charm. Twin two. One sister kills the other. So one sister kills the other, and then the other sister becomes one with her because she gets like a butterfly on her neck or something. And then the other sister is cast into the pit. I believe, if I'm understanding this correctly. Ooh. Here we go. Looks like we've got some twin on twin action. But not the good kind of twin on twin action. Oh, God. Oh, this is going to suck, isn't it? This is really going to suck. So let's hide here. Where is there she is? Right, first things first. Let's give her a blast of that. So she's stunned. Although that didn't appear. Didn't actually appear to give me the desired effect that I wanted. Now. Ah, shit. We're using the wrong bloody film as well, aren't we? Alright, let's switch up to the good stuff. I say good stuff marginally better stuff. Right, where are you? Where are you? Are you behind me? Yes, you are. There you are. Come on. Come to twin one. Ooh. Oh, so we can double tap her too. 
It's gonna be a little bit tricky. But we can. Come on. Oh, God, I didn't even see where the fuck she was. Okay. Yeah, she's cheating. She is confirmed to be cheating. She's so small as well. It's like really hard to actually see her. Come on. Where are you? Oh. Well, there you are. Jesus. That's sly. Okay. Let's give this a go. Right. One. And then two. Good night. Whoa, was it just the one that we had to fight? Don't tins... Tins? Yes, tins. Don't twins usually come in a double pack? Isn't that kind of like the whole point? Uh, anyway, whatever. Now, sh I don't think she's going to drop a crystal, because I suppose technically we've already had a crystal from her. Right, where does this go? Or is... Ah, wait, this is the room we came... Th yeah, we already came through there, didn't we? Okay. Now, how many camera points do we have? We'll have a look in a minute. There's something behind there. Film reel 4. This could probably be viewed with a projector. Yeah, probably. Alright, stay frosty. Ooh. The lid on the box is stuck fast. Okay. Do we need something to prise it open with? Doesn't mention any kind of tools that we need. I haven't missed. Well, technically we've missed the room back there, but okay. Ah. Yeah, so this was the room that was locked from the other side. Got ya. Ooh. Or was it? Objects is covered with a cloth. There's a lot of objects. Ooh, lovely. There's a lot of objects in this game that are covered with a cloth. Right, what I actually want to do... Uh, is go back. Because we have missed out one room. Which isn't acceptable. So let's go back. <clears throat> we might bump into some ghosts and ghouls along the way. One thing that would be nice is if they added a little bit more uh, variety, I suppose, to the environments. The environments are very, very similar. I mean, it's not a deal breaker, of course. But... Ooh. Yeah. You really didn't want to miss this room, did we? So one twin doesn't have a head. Got ya. Dollmaker's Note 3. An old book is on the doll stand. Uh, Arca Arcane damaged the mechanism to access the passageway and she took part of the doll. Uh, I have to restore the twin doll to normal and drop the possessed doll of... Uh, Azumi into the question mark to send that spirit back to hell but the path was the only way to the something right that path I guess that path that ooh there's a doll on display here it's about the same size of, as a real child
different place can be seen in the photo. Right. I'm not 100% sure where that is. There are two buttons carved with family crests on the box-like structure behind the doll. You tried pressing them, but nothing happened. Okay. So I'm guessing we need to go find this other place, as is tradition of these games. Okay. Glad we didn't miss this room out. This is why we always have to check every room before we move on. Uh, and to that, on that note, where does this one go? Right, so that was locked. Oh, right. Okay, cool. Swap. Let's put film four on. Ah, rad. Okay, cool, cool. <clears throat> Okay, so that appears to be the ritual. Alright, let's go. Let's go. So things are getting pretty strange around here. I mean, it makes sense that this is where a lot of the funky voodoo went down. So this is going to be a pretty horrific little place. Disappointed that there's nothing in that room. Could have been a nice sly little herbal medicine or maybe some uh, sacred water or something. But alas, no. Right, let's drop a save because I still don't trust this Xbox. <clears throat> Okay. Right, let's go. I'm guessing we might get something spoopy at the top of this staircase. No? Okay. Have that camera at the ready. Uh, looks like we've got multiple choices here. We do apparently not. Cabinet at your feet is filled with boxes. They seem to store old things that aren't being used anymore. Okay. Oh. I don't, oh. I don't really think anything here ooh, is being used anymore. Pinned down. Not a nice way to go. Ceiling and floor have crumbled down. You can see a room at the back, but you couldn't possibly get to it. Yeah. Well, okay. So we have... Ooh. What is this? Shivering woman. Okay. See, uh, we're not getting uh, points for these. At least, I don't... I think we are. Another spirit orb. We've got lots of spirit orbs though. Um. So what else have we got? Anything good? Hey, sacred water. We haven't had one of those for ages. In fact, how many of those do we even have? We've got five. Okay. What about the camera? Oh, we're close. We're close. We're actually starting to get these points at quite a rapid rate, to be fair. I guess we'll do that. Um, accumulation. I mean, that might be a good idea, accumulation, but I think we'll wait. Uh, oh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what's worth it. Um, see, stopping the movement of a spirit. See, the thing is, I don't know if that... 
if the spirit can't move, then I'm guessing you can't get a, a zero shot on it, which is not what we want. Slowing the spirit down, I can see the value of that. Uh, and finds the location of a spirit. That also is probably really bloody useful. Oh. I heard that. I heard that. Which one of you bastards said something? Hiding in the shadows. Like cowards. Cowards, I tell you. Ooh. Say this is a little bit more spooky. Corner woman. Did she have a name or? Door is broken and won't open. That's unfortunate. Okay, hey, we've got another save station down there. Um, I think we are coming up to the end of the video here. Not really sure as I've had to cut this video into two parts. So again, the lid is stuck fast. I don't know if we're going to get something that's going to help us open the lid. I don't have the answers to these questions. That's where we came from. Oh, we've got a passageway down. What I'm going to do, because I really don't know how long I've been um, playing this for, because of <laughs> the crashes we've had, um, I'm somewhat confident we're around half an hour, question mark-ish. Uh, I'm going to leave this one here. This one might end up being a bit of a shorter video, but yeah, I really don't want to go too far over half an hour, so <clears throat> um, I'm going to peace out here. So, thanks for watching, guys, and when we come back, uh, hopefully we're going to find this bridge, because this house is pretty freaking big. Uh, I guess you'd imagine it would be pretty freaking big, considering this is the twin house where all the shit went down, where the twins were actually put into holding i guess until the ritual uh, was pulled off um but yeah there's some interesting stuff here like the twin room where there's two of everything i'm guessing these girls were like kind of really looked after you know they had lots of toys and lots of things to play with and all that kind of stuff you know before they were horribly murdered so i mean there's that anyway till next time guys